60 Cycle Hum's coverage of Winter NAM 2020 is brought to you by Line 6, Daddario Strings, Rev Amplifiers, Singular Sound, Coast Sonic, and Harmony Guitars. <laughs> I'm Ryan, you're watching 60 Cycle Hum. I'm at Winter Dam 2020, you already knew that. Playing the new Fender Lead 2. It's a reissue of a guitar they made in the 80s that I've always wanted. I've always wanted one of these. I've got a knockoff that I've had for ever, over a decade, that looks a lot like this, the red and black colorway. But man, I saw this bright bright green and I just had to pick it up it plays pretty decent it is a Mexican build uh, I think these are gonna be like 600 bucks something like that very affordable as you can hear it has an out-of-phase switch there's two great big beefy switches on these things one is a pickup selector and one is the out-of-phase here is the bridge pickup middle neck I feel like I should switch to a clean channel so you can hear exactly what's going on. Pretty thin and small sounding. There's the out of phase sound. I'm a little surprised how thin it sounds. Let's beef it up with a, a crunch channel. I've never actually played one of the original ones. I think I might have played one, but not plugged in. I might have picked one up and strummed it at a uh, pawn shop or something. I'm a little surprised at how thin it sounds. It's kind of a Mustang-y sort of sound. <laughs> Neck pickup. This is my crunch channel. It's usually a lot crunchier than this. It's, they're a really low output pickup. That is interesting. Let's try one of the lead threes, which are humbucker equipped. What color will I do? It's kind of dark here. I want to play. I just pulled the wall hanger off the wall. <laughs> I want to play this purple one. Is it going to show up on camera? Yeah, good enough. All right, let's see how the humbucker does. But there's more output here with the humbucker equipped lead three. Hopefully we're in tune. Still plenty twangy sounding. Position sounds nice. 
Am I going to like the humbucker one better than the single coil? <laughs> I think I am. Ooh, when? There's some beef to that neck pickup. The next feel uh, pretty dang nice on this. I mean, it's a standard kind of Mexican strat kind of feel. A little bit of tactile response to the frets. Nothing, you know, super high end for a $600 guitar. <laughs> I guess with the lead twos, if you're looking for like a Mustang sound with those singles, that's the way to go. If you're looking for a more modern, punchy sound, the lead three is probably it. A lot of variation between the bridge and the neck pickup on this. Let's check out that out of phase setting. In phase, out of phase. Oh wait. There's a three position here, so it's not the same. Huh, I should have read up on these and figured out what the controls do. It's a coil cut. You can coil cut the bridge or the neck pickup. I got photobombed by the Steve. He's picking up a Mustang bass over there. Right away, I'm... I'm I'm leaning hard into the lead three as the one that I'm into, which isn't really a surprise. Uh, on the copy of, a, uh, of the lead that I have at home that's not at all a Fender, I have a hot humbucker in it. So that's what I think about these guitars, is I want them to be hot humbucker, kind of punk rock machines. like. <laughs> Let's find some higher gain stuff. be wrong about the switching. I don't know everything about these guitars. But damn, this purple one's pretty. And those humbuckers have plenty of output. I mean, this plays like a $600 Mexican Fender. So there's no surprises there. But if you have been jonesing for a Fender lead, they make them now. They make them and they sell them. And there's two different flavors. There's humbucker and there's single. Uh, the single, like I said, sounds a lot like a Mustang, kind of thin and low output pickup. <laughs> and uh, the humbuckers sound the way you would expect. And there's uh, some different switching here that maybe I don't completely understand. So anyways, thanks for watching. Please like, subscribe, dislike. Leave me rude and nasty comments. Support us on Patreon. Support the sponsors by clicking the links. You know the whole drill. You know what to do. All right, stay grounded. Bye, everyone. <laughs>